Hey YouTube, so today's video is actually going to be on a request from one of my subscribers. She personally messaged me about this. Um, it's because she's a young parent and her daughter is becoming an infant pretty soon. She's starting to walk and she wants to get a little tip on what she will need in her bag because she's saying personal things so I don't want to say it but this is for all the young mothers or mothers that needs this help and knows what to put in an infant slash toddler bag so if you guys want to see how I packed my daughter's bag stay tuned okay so this is my daughter's everyday bag if so she will be using her juicy couture one but that is rarity because that's a really expensive bag and I don't want that to get messed up so this is her everyday bag she uses yes. so it has two outside pockets and a big one in the back and two in the front yeah okay so on the outside you always always have to have a water cup because you don't want your daughter to be dehydrated as she will be the most fussiest little girl ever because i that happened to me once so i had to buy a water bottle so always have a water cup with you next in the outside pocket i keep it in a plastic bag i have a two gold baby lotion the Johnson's I love this I even have the bigger size one that I use on her every time after she takes a bath also have her Tylenol and fever medicine just in case it comes along because this is over-the-counter kind of make um makeup <laughs> so yeah She's finishing up this, still has more, and this one was for when she had, um, really, when she was really, really sick. So just have that just in case they catch a cold wherever you are. And I always had this, but she finished it up. This is like a syringe or something like, um, when she has liquid medicine that is prescribed to her. I'm gonna have a thermometer. Um, I heard like the rear is better than anywhere else to get her temperature, but I don't like seeing my daughter in pain like that. So I have the one for her armpits. Yeah. So you put this under her arms and put it down and let it do its thing. Next, you wanna have this syringe thing too. This is really important when your daughter or son has the runny runny nose this is this is your best friend when they have that so I always have this okay so in the next pocket it's really optional but I already know how the weather is so I know what to pack um, I got this from my working place you can get it anywhere I know here on YouTube a lot of people have different kind of socks like this but mine's was only like a dollar at my working place. And it's this really soft furry socks. You can see how soft and furry it looks. Um, I love putting this on her legs when I bring her out and she has shorts and it gets really cold. So she loves using this so much. She loves it. I think I have a video on it. This is what she was wearing when she was dancing. So if you guys want to see, um, I'll post her link of that video of her using this down below or on the screen. Next, for on that long car rides or and it's a sunny day, you always want to have a little accessory for your daughter or kid. And my daughter loves Dora, so I got her Dora shades. This is so cute, she loves wearing it. I also have this Gerber baby lotion in berry she loves this I had to buy another lotion too because she loves playing with lotion she knows how to um, not get it messy but <sighs> this smells so good it smells like one of the body lotions I used to wear a long time ago um, 
hold on let me go get it i think it's in the bathroom okay so i got it um yeah it smells exactly like this yeah it does it smells exactly the same so this one is from bath and body works and this smell is the sun ripened raspberry yeah so this is the one that exactly smells like this gerber lotion so that was it for the outside pocket next you want to get any finger foods or snacks that they can eat while they're hungry and they're in the car too the long car rides my daughter has like different flavors of this yeah so this is like the second one um i will have a haul up later on on all the stuffs i got so you gotta have the finger foods because when they're fussy they want to eat something you can eat this and this is really healthy it's not like you're gonna give them a lollipop or like gummy bears as long as they're organic <laughs> okay so next is baby powder always have baby powder so when it's like a hot day and start getting sticky and sweaty you can put this all over their body and mainly when you change his or her diaper you always will have to have this okay. so next you want to have extra clothes just in case when she gets messy okay sorry about that but you also have to have extra clothes so in case she gets messy or he gets messy you have extra clothes to change them before they're going to be naked wherever you go so always have so i have a napkin why am i saying napkin um always have a jacket and extra pants shirts and she has like this one piece that is perfect when you're on the go and you don't have time to always change them next since my daughter is still drooling um you want to have extra bibs inside your bag because you want her to have like one bib throughout the whole day and it's like all wet and gets onto their clothes so always have bibs next you want to have their lumping i think that's what you say yeah in filipino or like these cloths so you can put them on your shoulder when they're sleeping or to wipe their mouth And you also want to have diapers, diapers, diapers. It depends on how long you're going to stay out. So I am always, always get like four to five diapers just in case. Because you don't know when you change your diaper. Then she'll make doo-doo and then you have to rechange it again. And then she'll have pee. And so that's why I always have a lot of diapers. Next, in this Hello Kitty, it's a zipper. She has like alcohol swabs. Uh, rubber bands hair pins and yeah that's it in here but I mainly put it in here from what I'm gonna say in this one in here it has alcohol swabs and all kinds of sizes of band-aids um, there's like from humongo ones like these to like oh my gosh it's gonna be so hard to put them back to like smaller ones to big ones like there's like so much of them see how small this one is so always have different size because you don't know if it might be from your daughter or the other kid or child because i've used this from for other people <laughs> next you always want to have baby wipes yes baby wipes because you have to wipe down there with these not no napkin it will give your child a rash next um you can get this at babies r us or wherever but there's this full big size or a smaller one i had to get the big one it depends on how messy your child is i got the bigger one so i take this on the go everywhere and it helps me when you have to wipe her hand after she drinks or um after she eats her finger food snacks and sometimes you can also use these on when you know you go grocery shopping and put your child inside um the cart yeah you can wipe it and get it sanitized so this is really 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 good i love this um i will get a haul on all the stuffs i got at baby stars so that was it i hope you guys have 
a great day i hope this video gave you a lot of tips on how to pack your child's bag if you guys have any more questions on this video please comment me below or message me here on youtube so until next time i'll see you guys in my next